a pleasure to be here with Anirudh Bhattacharjee. Uh, welcome, sir, to the Kolkata Literature Festival. You are going to be soon part of a session called "Kya Yehi Pyar Hai," where all of you are united by the fact that you've written biographies on some of India's most popular and well-loved personalities. So firstly, what are you most looking forward to talking about in the session? What aspect of the conversation do you want to bring forward? Well, in a sense, uh, I look forward to talking about my icon, Kishore Kumar here. because my latest uh, like work is on him uh, basically like uh, on his life in the sense it is it is less about his music like you see uh, what i find that kishore kumar is a grossly uh, misunderstood man right so the book we have written me and my friend parthiv dhor is uh primarily about kishore kumar the man okay he struggled uh, till he became kishore kumar so that like uh, i would try and discuss the, uh, like same in my uh yeah my talk show right so when you talk about kishore kumar the man uh, all of us have seen him from a distance we've known him primarily through his music through his films but we haven't really had much of an insight into his personal life or into how he was as an individual what about him briefly if you could sum up maybe in two or three things stood out defined kishore kumar the man number 1 that kishore uh, kumar he was a loner number 2 he was a lateral thinker and lastly he was not a miser as say, like portrayed by the media and you've also written exemplary books on rd burman on sd burman and of course there's a lot of mutual history between these personalities and kishore kumar so any sort of interesting anecdotes or stories that you found across writing across research that made it to the book that you would like to share in brief ah uh, there are many and uh, it would be a tad difficult to cite uh, all of them here say for example uh i will be discussing how kishore kumar he met uh, sd for the first time that is one and what was rd's role during those times uh, like it is not known that rd used to get uh, like chai for them so like from uh, simple chai wala uh, just a minute uh, just a minute so uh like uh, kishore kumar's growth say in the bombay film uh, industry somehow coincided with the growth of rd burman as well right so like that's very interesting part like which uh, i have uh, like tried to uh, capture in my uh, book as uh, well but uh, as i said it's a span of uh, like around 20 years and like rather difficult to sum it up in uh, like two lines right now uh, but what what would you say made the personal rapport between adi burman and kishore kumar so special we know about their professional collaboration we've all heard and seen how beautifully they created magic together but what was it among the personal connection that they shared that made them so wonderful as a as a part as a partnership as a team number 1 uh Kishore Kumar used to say whatever i am uh, today is because of one man Sachin Dev Burman so th- he had a kind of a filial uh, uh, like affection for his son that was number 1 number 2 kishore was uh, basically uh, like uh, at heart a simple man and rd also he was a simple guy so somewhere the 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 simplicity it, it, it did like rub into each other i think that helped okay my final question is you worked on three music stalwarts of the indian industry are you looking forward to any other stories any other musicians in sort of bollywood history or indian history that you want to write your next book on we are planning a book on uh, lata mangeshkar Hmm. and my like next book it is supposed to release next month only it's on the films of basu chatterjee 
आई बिलीव यू वर्ड ऑफ हिम फिल्म लाइक रजनीगंधा छोटी सी बात चिचोर कट्टा मिट्टा सो लाइक होपफुली इट शुड बी देयर नेक्स्ट मंथ एंड इट इज इट इज ओनली फोकस्ड ऑन हिज वर्क वंडरफुल थैंक यू सो मच सर हैव अ ग्रेट टाइम एट के एल एफ